Hi, my name is Guy Yalif. I'm the co-founder and CEO of Intellimize. We help performance marketers drive better conversion by changing their websites, personalizing them for each individual visitor that shows up. And we built a predictive personalization system to automate that. A question I get often is, how does predictive personalization drive higher conversions? Let's walk through an example to illustrate how it might compare to each of us doing something we're familiar with, running an A-B test. If I have two ideas I want to test and I use an A-B testing system to test them off against each other, here's what that might look like. Here's time. Here's the percent of traffic going to each of my two variations. And let's say this is 100%. So I'm going to, while the test is running, watch the system allocate half of my traffic to A and half of my traffic to B. I'll keep an eye on the system, make sure things are running smoothly, and hope that I see a statistically significant difference between A and B. And let's say that happens. Let's say that happens here, and B is the winner. I'll then go to engineering and ask them to code B into the base website, and it will get all of my traffic from then on. That'll be great because I'll see a lift in performance because B outperformed A. Predictive personalization works differently. It starts reallocating traffic based on performance to drive better conversions as soon as you start your campaign. Here's how that might work. If I run the same test in a predictive personalization system, here's time, here's the percent of traffic. We'll start with 50-50 for AB but as the system sees that B is performing better, it'll start allocating more traffic to B long before you would have reached statistical significance. Then when you reach significance, or would have, it's still going to serve some traffic to A because A is right for someone. It was the right answer for some portion of your population. And then, over time, as the world changes, as you change your marketing efforts and start attracting different types of users that behave differently, and maybe for them A is better more often, a predictive personalization system will react to that and start allocating more traffic to A in response to the change in user behavior. And so predictive personalization drives more conversions than A-B testing because you will get incremental conversions here where you pull in the moment of reallocating traffic so you get faster results. You'll get incremental conversions here because you're personalizing what each person sees, not doing winner take all, and so you get better results. And then you'll get incremental conversions here because the system will automate experiment management and keeping an eye on users so that you can adjust as the world changes. My hope is that this gives you a sense of how predictive personalization will drive better and higher and faster conversions than A-B testing.